Allow me to reintroduce myself. My name is 3.4. What's going on, world? How are you? Welcome back to Channel 3.4. This is another episode of Music Felt by Me. We're checking out the last of the two bonus tracks from The Death of Slim Shady. This is a track to like my stuff. I don't, I'm in the really early in the video. They're going to like demonetize this. Probably will get copyrighted anyway. So it's called Like My Shit, I guess. It's called Like <laughs> That's it. I don't have to bite my tongue here. I don't have to censor myself because uh, UMG's going to take the money anyway. So um, let's get right into this. I finished the project. As you guys may know, there's a, a playlist available on the channel. If you guys want to go, you can see all the uh, Death of Slim Shady reactions. Um, I'm also going to be doing a final thoughts, kind of a recap and in, in explaining my logic of interpretation of the album. And then uh, we'll probably do a tier list video of every song. Um, also so uh be on the lookout for more death of slim shady content uh and we're on the road to 100,000 subscribers i need you yeah you every single one of you that's watching this right now that is not yet subscribed make sure you hit that subscribe button we're on the road to 100,000 subscribers we got such a long long way to go but i've set a personal goal for myself to get to the 100,000 plaque 100,000 subscriber plaque by the end of next year so each and every single one of you that wants to be part of building the community building the journey you guys can talk in the comment section join the discord come be a part of something we're building something very naturally very organically so just come join and uh let's get right into this like my shit eminem yep. Yeah, all right okay all right so first off it starts off with my dad died oh he's still on my bad side that's how i know that i'm back on my shit because i'm that fly back on my shit fly shit you know um but but yeah also like i'm kind of back on my function like, like my dad died you're still on my bad side <laughs> there's a i think there's another play there too where he says so call me the Titanic Y. I've been known to fuck up entire crews. Treat your clique like I'm trying on fitted hats. I'm capsizing you like a waiter. I'd waiter do. Or like a waiter do. But also when you like wade in the water, you know. If you guys know who this is down in the comment section, let me know. Was, um, uh, what's his name? Sway Lee? And tease this ain't Tizo, is it? Okay, all right. So it says, "Bitch, you got one television, and and the one that you have is cheap. It's like when they test your blood. That shit is a plasma screen. My house is like Alfred E. Newman's. Bitch, I got Mad TVs. Alfred E. Newman is the mascot of Mad, right? And then also, I got a whole lot of issues." in mad magazines so it's like i got a whole lot of issues like he's got a lot of trauma and a lot of mental issues and a lot of magazines you hear like the gun clicking a little bit uh or whatever you know getting loaded up there um but also mad magazine alfred e newman Okay, so he killed Slim Shady, uh, or Slim Shady's gone, I guess, whatever. Uh, and he is just leaning into some of the dad jokey stuff here. I got a whole lot of issues in Mad Magazines. Turn the thermostat all the way up. It's the only way you're going to blast the heat, right? You're not going to shoot anybody. The only time you blast these is if you turn your thermometer all the way up, the thermostat up. Call you leisure wear like V-necks. Because all y'all just casual tees and also casualties like uh, victims, innocent victims, or you know people killed uh, <laughs> as a casualty. Critics I don't rap to please. They be like that brand of greens. Label them Del Monte because everybody you can appease. They can appease Del Monte canned food there. I, the reason why I say that Sway Lee or Tizo Touchdown because there's a lot of thought that everyone that was in the Doomsday 2 video was going to be on the Eminem project. And uh, both of them were in the video, I believe. So I'm trying to see who this who this is here. <laughs> Came up in a world that never really gave a crap about me. Two months, my dad was Audi. Blew up, then he bragged about me. That's crazy. 
Oh, season. I was wondering, it's like it's like I have the Lowry's. I'm a seasoning, right? It's like a salt, Lowry salt, or a seasoning salt, something like that. Uh, talk about season the moment. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mmm, mmm. I got jumped at checkers. Damn. Damn. All right, so Checkers rallies the restaurant. I got jumped at Checkers, but across the board, the game had to crown me. So when I got jumped in Checkers, came across the board, had to crown me. Okay, all right. All right, that was dope. <laughs> okay, all right, creative. Wit it's clever. Clever. Said I'm just all right. <laughs> Jesus Christ. When I look back at how these kids' kids in my class would clown me, said I'm just a huge waste. Well, that must make these rappers belt, because now they all feel so small that they won't even wrap around me. I'm such a huge waste, your belts won't even wrap around me. You goddamn right, I'm a huge waste. That's wild. That's wild. That, that means all the other rappers, you guys must be real small because your belts won't even wrap around me. So I must be a huge waste. Mm -hmm. They call me the Grand Canal B because I'll be damned if rap ain't damned without me. Mm -hmm. God damn you. He's so freaking good at rapping it's unbelievable even if some of the the, the punchlines are jokey and kind of dad jokey like okay slapstick his ability to rap is unbelievable keeping it grand like a damn finale like keeping it a thousand right keeping it grand like a damn finale coup de gras i shot to, shot to superstardom it's like the death blow but also like if you i wonder if you you could break down Superstar Dome into Superstar's Dome, and he like he shot Slim Shady. Maybe I don't. I don't know. I could be reaching. Coup de gras as I shot the Superstardom. Who'd have thought that my medulla oblongata screwed up thoughts could do to toddlers? But I grew up on ramen noodles. Combination of post trauma due to mama got me off my rocker. Human llama. Human human llama. <laughs> Whatever. Right? Is that for a rap god there? And it, he took that for something too, right? Human llama. Um. Yeah, what the fuck is that from? Human llama, human llama. Uh, but I grew up on ramen noodles. Combination of post-trauma. Due to mama got me off my rocker human llama. But everything is not Hakuna Matata. How many people rhyme Hakuna Matata in their raps? Like that's <laughs> Broke up combination of post-trauma. Post Excuse me. The way he breaks up combination. Like I said, grew up on ramen noodles. Combination of post-trauma. Due to mama, but he said he even used combo as a rhyme. I I grew up on a ramen, grew up grew up on ramen noodles combination of post trauma due to mama got me off my rock a human llama. That was just goddamn. He rhymes everything. Mm -hmm. Damn, yo, it's the it's the one it's the quick ones. It's the ones you can miss that just do it they just do it man like but i pour my heart into this ink or i pour my heart into the ink in these letters i tear you apart as i piece it together how am i so sick if i keep getting better i pour my heart into the ink of these letters i tear you apart like like tearing your heart apart like you know breaking your heart as i piece it together how am I so sick if I keep getting better? Damn, but every <laughs> damn, this CD has a compact disc. This tech is not for no TED talk, but every word that comes from my lip bomb, like every word that comes from my lip bomb, like I'm chapstick. CD has a motherfucking compact disc, bombastic. Yo, that's crazy. <laughs> Mmm, mmm, nice. 
But every word that come from my lip bomb like I'm chapstick. CD is a motherfucking compact disc. Bombastic. I'm ahead of my time and my watch fast, bitch. I'm strapped safety off that bitch. Hop back with this paper mate and the pen will be the only thing I'm not capping. God damn. Sheesh. Yo, <laughs> He fucking clobbered these bonus tracks. Then I hop back with this paper mate. <laughs> fucking. I'm ready to start. I'm ready to start shooting. This motherfucking pen's the only thing that I'm not capping. So I'm going to cap everything, everyone in front of me. Everything in front of me. That's crazy. Mm, okay. Too much paper now. I'm stacking. You can't take it like dog aspirin. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, ain't alcohol, but I'm as strong as it. If rap was liquor, this song has it. So if you don't want to get wasted, these ain't the kind of bars that you want to take shots at. Then. Damn. He's saying, like, this this space right here is not the kind of bars that you want to start taking shots at because you don't really want that problem. But also taking shots while you're at a bar. Damn, if rappers like this song has it, damn, you don't want to get wasted. Like, you know, if you don't want to get drunk, get wasted. But also, if you don't want to get wasted, Grand Theft Auto wasted fucking <laughs> thing. Uh, if you don't want to get wasted, then these kind of bars ain't, ain't the, or these ain't the kind of bars that you want to take shots at. Then, damn, that shit is hard. That shit is hard. As as quirky and kind of like dad jokey some of the stuff was in this, he had a few schemes in this that is unbelievable. <laughs> good record. Good record. Those bonus tracks are really good. I like them a lot. They're perfect bonus tracks. They're extras. They're really enjoyable. They're not necessarily, they're not canon to the story. Good bonus tracks. I like it. I like it. I'm going to go 91 on that one, actually. I like it a lot. That was really good. Damn. Some of those bars, that was... He did some rapping. You know, V-Nags, y'all casualties. Okay, all right, all right, okay. But really, when he started with the... Um, talk about season the moment with the Lowry's, that was kind of like the last one that was like... Okay. I got jumped at Checkers. But across the board, the game had to crown me. I think from that point on, he was kind of cooking. He was cooking. That's going to do it for me, everyone. Like I said, be on the lookout for the my final thoughts on the album and the tier list uh, for all the tracks. That's going to do it for me. Be safe. Be real. Don't forget to pursue your own happiness. And uh, hit that subscribe button. I'll catch you on the next one. Thank you to Patreon and YouTube members. Afrado, Joseph Green, Jeremy Visser, Clay Hopkins.